Conoin Member of Parliament Brighton Yegon has been questioned by detectives from the Criminal Investigating Department over the invasion of multinational tea companies in Kericho County. Yegon, who was grilled in Bomet County, has stated that the violence emerged following concerns by a section of residents who claim that they lost their jobs after the adoption of tea plucking machines by tea factories in the region. In the chaos that erupted outside a Katera Tea Estate on the 22nd of May 2023, seven tea plucking machines were torched by angry residents who destroyed property worth millions of shillings. According to the chairperson of Kenya Tea Growers Association, Silas Njibwakale, in the past six months alone, a Katera Tea Estate and James Finlay have lost 170 million shillings through theft of tea in farms and destruction of property. So far, Kericho Governor Eric Mutai, Ainamoy MP Benjamin Langat, and eight MCAs from Kericho and Bomet counties have been interrogated. Machines were brought in. It, it actually um, rendered a number of our people uh, uh, to, to be unemployed. These are contemporary issues. And we believe uh, they can be sorted um, uh, using dialogue. They can be sorted uh, on a round table so that uh, there is peace uh, across uh, Kericho and Bomet. As leadership of Kericho County, we came out strongly to condemn any sense of hooliganism and any sense of the structures of property. But while still holding the view that whatever grievances our people has, we'll still continue discussing the same, but in a very good, cordial environment. 